Hi guys, I'm Blue and I swear I was already planning to watch this movie before everything happened. I obviously know what Titanic is all about because I've heard a great deal about it and it's one of those like really classic movies that, you know, a lot of people talk about and I'm pretty sure I've seen it when I was little broadcasted on the TV, but you know, I'm not, I'm from Bulgaria, so broadcasted TV is very different, plus commercial breaks, everything, you go do something during the commercial and then you come back and, you know, some time has passed from the movie, so there are gonna be scenes that I have not seen from this. There's a lot of scenes that I have seen on the internet. And due to recent events, obviously, I've also seen, like, a lot of... Because, you know, you scroll on TikTok, you watch a few things of the submarine. Also, a lot of things popped up on my feed about, like, survivors from the Titanic. Actually, there's only one. Oh, but that, that was quite an old film. So, currently, I think there are no survivors from it. But I watched, like, a documentary or something, or parts of a documentary, an interview, where the, the last survivor could, like, that could actually speak about it and remember it, was telling about how it all went down and stuff. And she was, like, 80, 90 years old or something. And uh, she was, like, a kid when, when it happened. So it happened, I think, in 1920, if I'm not mistaken. But I will see just now. Yeah, 1912. I was close. So that is more than 100 years ago. 100 and... A hundred and eleven years ago. I am not a mathematician. Math has never been my strong side, so correct me if I'm wrong. But yeah, let's watch Titanic. <laughs> if you want to see the full reaction, check it out in the Patreon links down below in the description. And also for early access to my videos, you can become a member on YouTube and from Instagram and OnlyFans and Twitter. Check the links down below as well. Okay, let's go. Yeah, of course. That song, iconic. Like, we all know the scene, the song. This is already making me tear up, no! I, I have to say this, I really hate the ocean. Like, I would never. <laughs> like, I think you're crazy to go on the ocean. <laughs> you have to be some sort of crazy. Like, it's so deep, it's insane. It's so deep. This is 3,000 meters below surface level. 3,000. And it's much darker than this. No light could illuminate it this, this good. Okay, and it's so scary. It's so f***ing scary. Are these just drones or are they actual people inside? Because I don't think that technology existed back then. What? Oh no, is that another PlayStation joystick? What's up with submarines and PlayStation joysticks? Oh, I'm getting goosebumps. Oops, somebody left the water running. Hey, hold it, hold it just a second. Go back to the right. Really? Really you're gonna make that joke? <gasps> is that a safe? Oh, baby, baby, are you seeing this, boss? Wow. Are they just gold diggers? Are they just digging for like... Day, boys. What? What? You're not even like a historical aficionados wanting to know more about the ship and journalism and stuff like that. You just dig him for treasures. Guys, look, you just got to trust my instincts. I know we're close. We just got to go through a little process of elimination. How is this possible? How is this recoverable? This is paper, right? Paper right that's back. been on the ocean floor for years, decades. How are they just recovering it? That's her! Unseen at the bottom of the ocean for eternity. Oh my god, damn. <laughs> the woman in the picture is me. <laughs> wow, she was so young and beautiful. I hate aging. Rose to Whitbicator died on the Titanic when she was 17, right? 17? What? Is she 17 in that picture? The okay, dog! She is so poised still. 
Louis the Sixteenth was Leonardo DiCaprio. Wasn't I a dish? <laughs> Oh, why am I getting emotional now? Are you ready to go back to Titanic? <gasps> and her whole ass sticking up in the air. And that's a big <laughs> ass. We're talking 20, 30. <gasps> Who let this guy lead the explanation? <laughs> this guy is so insensitive. That fine forensic analysis, Mr. Bodine. Well, yeah, some years have passed. Will you share it with us? Is the whole movie her story? Oh, I'm gonna cry. No. The whole movie is her story. What? Oh no, I didn't come here trying to be ugly crying, but I feel like that's coming. The ship of dreams. And it was. <laughs> it really was. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Oh, this is so sad. No. All oh, these people. Oh, damn. She was rich. I don't see what all the fuss is about. What? Your daughter is far too difficult to impress. She's not impressed. She's not so even. This is the ship they say is unsinkable. Ah. It is unsinkable. Oh, no. Oh, no. No. They really said that. They really said that about this is the most this is irony in the peakest of the forms that the world could ever serve irony. And also they said about the submarine indestructible or something. It's just so ironic. I feel like everything related to the Titanic is just such bad luck. It's just bad luck. You don't mess with bad juju. <gasps> Oh no! Oh no! He won the tickets? That is the most unfortunate win in the history. Somebody's life's about to change. You don't know even how right you are. I'm sorry, Fabrizio. Get sorry, my wife, fan culo. Do you bet all of mine? Sorry, I haven't seen your mom again for a long time. Oh no! We're going to America. Full house, boys. No. <laughs> He really isn't gonna see his mom. Come <laughs> on, No, no. Okay, okay. Let's be happy for them just in this moment. They're gonna die later, but let's be happy for them. Nothing could go wrong. The Titanic is unsinkable. Oh, oh my God. Uh, put it in there. In the wow, so much luggage. They're just moving in there. They're living there now. With nothing out ahead of us but ocean. Oh, this is terrifying. Whoa, this is... <laughs> the backstage is intense. Oh no, I feel so bad for them. They think that they're so lucky to be there. Do you know if Dr. Freud misdrews me? His ideas oh. about the male preoccupation with science might be oh. of interest to you. Oh! Damn! Okay, okay, yeah. She does sound like a 17-year-old. <laughs> oh, he... Nice, huh? Is so talented. Like how the angels fly out of your arse is getting next to the likes of her. Nah, he said his mind. Oh no, the double look. She's interested. She knows it. What are you doing? No. Girl. No, you won't. <laughs> no, won't. He's so scared. You're distracting me. Go away. I can't. I'm involved. Now. You're distracting me. How cold? <laughs> Freezing. Maybe a couple degrees. That's away. what's gonna change your mind. You can't breathe. You can't think. You know, there's people that take ice baths. I bet those people they're preparing if something that like that happens to them. There's people taking ice baths for a minute every day. You're crazy. So, takes one to know one. With all due respect, miss. <laughs> <laughs> That was so good. Come on. 
She's gonna slip! Oh my god. That was so real, like, the whole weight. He reassured her, he's the perfect man! Ah! And he's Leonardo DiCaprio when he was young. You stand back and don't move an inch! Fetch the master arm! No, it's not what it looks like. Completely unacceptable. Why isn't she saying anything? I was leaning far over to see the uh, propellers and I slipped and I would have gone overboard. But Why does he look like he's a member of Fallout Boy? <laughs> Her fiance looks. <laughs> doesn't he? <laughs> it's interesting. The young lady slipped so suddenly and you still had time to remove your jacket and your shoes. It wasn't like that. It wasn't like that. They all think that something else happened. She literally was gonna kill herself. I know you've been melancholy. Melancholy. Pretend to know why. <laughs> Is that what they called it? <laughs> okay, that's it. Perhaps as a reminder of my feelings for you. Is it a diamond? Yes. <laughs> wow. But you wouldn't get her! She is complicated, okay? She's going through a little moment. She's a little wild child. God, look at that thing. <laughs> gone straight to the bottom. <laughs> you love him? Does it sound like she does? You're being very rude. You're the one! <laughs> you just. Well, it's a simple question. You just you love the guy told him the whole life story. I thought you were leaving. <laughs> this is my part of the ship. You leave. Oh, oh, oh. Well, well, well. You're part of the ship. <laughs> it's like looking at nudes on your phone in public, like. <laughs> but the purpose of university is to find a suitable husband. <laughs> <laughs> the purpose of university is to find a husband. Wow. Teach me to ride like a man. Like a man? Like a and spit like a man. What, they didn't teach you that in <laughs> finishing school? No. <laughs> Come on, I'll show you. Let's do it. <laughs> spit like a man. It was pitiful. Come on, you really gotta hock it back, you know? <laughs> Get some leverage to it and use your arms. <laughs> Those Arc people in the back! <laughs> <laughs> I've had so many boys trying to teach me how to burp and I never could. I can't. I just can't do it. May I introduce Jack Dawson? Ew! No! Do something about that! No! <laughs> Ew! What are you planning to wear? Oh, she's so nice! Look, she's talking to him, she's giving him advice. Oh no, she's gonna... Oh! I was right. You and my son are just about the same size. Pretty close. Yay, she's the best! I love her! Good evening, sir. Wow, look at him. Actually, fun story, I have old pictures of my father and he looks exactly like young Leonardo DiCaprio. He feels so out of place, I can tell it, but he looks like he is born for this lifestyle. He is just <laughs> learning the mannerisms. She'll be along. There is the he didn't even recognize him! He didn't even recognize- Oh my god. A moment going down the stairs is what every girl needs in her life. I've never had it myself, but... The way the, the looks turn, and you're going down the stairs, and your man is just standing there like... Whoa. You could almost pass for a gentleman. Almost. Extraordinary. Ha wow, he just left his woman with him, okay? His number one mistake is underestimating Jack. Sweet pea. Jack Sweet over pea. there with the two ladies. The two coolest ladies in this room! Tell us of the accommodations in steerage, Mr. Dawson. I hear they're quite good on Oof, she is a snake. Best she I've is seen, the head rats. snake. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I've always hated caviar. No caviar for me, thanks. 
Never did like it much. Yeah, yeah, same. It tastes weird, okay? It tastes like fish and sea, and it's horrible. I, I don't like the taste of fish. All life is a game of luck. Hmm. Wow. A real man makes his own luck, Archie. Ah! <laughs> I figure life's a gift, and I don't intend on wasting it. Rose is like drinking up every single word he's saying. To make each day count. Well said, Jack. Yeah, yeah. Yeah! To make me count. To make me count. Oh, he's always. <gasps> Oh my god, yeah, I read this somewhere, or I've heard about this, The Leonardo DiCaprio is always raising a glass in his movies. He's gonna ask her to meet him! <laughs> it's the poor people's party! You're still my best girl, Cora. Oh. They're having a little dance off. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I would throw up, absolutely. <laughs> okay, she's in her manic pixie phase right now. <laughs> Hold this for me, Jack. Hold it up. Oh my god, what is she gonna do? <laughs> the anticipation. No. No, that's not possible. <laughs> Oh, ew, ew! That life is making me anxious. No, it's horrible. You will never behave like that again, Rose. Do you understand? Wow, wow, wow. Okay, Dad. I didn't ask you to be my daddy. Thank you. I feel pain. Yes, you are. And my wife in practice, if not yet by law, so you will. Okay, walk out, girl. Walk out. The way a wife is required to honor her husband. This Kyle behavior will not fly. Okay, go back to your boy band. You are not to see that boy again. You understand me? Or what, Rose. mom? Or what? I forbid it. You're gonna write me off your will? Stop it, mother. You'll give yourself a nosebleed. I don't understand you. Hmm. Okay. Match with Hockley. It will ensure our survival. All right. Fair enough. She has to look out for the family. But you, you know, so she selfish? doesn't want this burden. Why don't you remarry? Our choices are never easy. Back in the day, you didn't have much of choices, to be honest. Please, I just want to speak to Rose for Adrian, one second. All right. Please see that Mr. Please. Dawson gets back to where he belongs and that he stays there. Wow. Wow. Come along, you. Quite normal for this time of year. In fact, we're speeding up. I've just ordered the last boilers lit. Yes. Yes, of course, because ice warnings mean that you have to speed up. I don't think so. Look, they've got you trapped, Rose. Everyone's going to die. die if you don't Nothing Maybe matters. Not right away because we're strong, but I'm going back. Leave me alone. Right after your fiance like threw a table at you. <gasps> oh, it's coming. It's coming. <laughs> She's like, I just did that like yesterday. You trust me? Wow. I trust you. Alright. Flying. <laughs> oh. I'm having goosebumps. This is so much better than a kiss moment. So much more intimate than just a kiss. Then that guy he talked about first was like, don't even think about it. He didn't know. This is so romantic. No. Jack, I want you to draw me like one of your French girls. Wearing this. He doesn't even realize it yet. His brain. Wearing only this. <laughs> you want to tell me that she's 17? Put your arm back the way it was. Oh, but I couldn't stay still like that for so long. No way. Thank God for cameras. 
I know it's different though. It's different when someone draws you. But I would like them to take a picture and draw the picture instead of, <laughs> instead of me posing like that. But I know that a lot of people want to do it actually. Stay still. It has certain charm to posing <sighs> like that. Oh, his eyes. He loves her. <laughs> Look at his eyes. <laughs> I believe you were blushing, Mr. Big Artist. <laughs> this is such a beautiful moment. <laughs> I knew they were gonna do the transition. I knew it. <laughs> My heart was pounding the whole time. It was the most dramatic <laughs> moment of my life. <laughs> Look, there's only so many places she could be. Love Joy, find her. Love Joy? Love Joy? Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, they're gonna kill her! She doesn't give a shit anymore. That's it. That horse has left the rails. The, the train has left the rails. The ship has sailed. The ship has sailed. <laughs> oh no! They're just taking the premium tour. They're so happy. <laughs> running away from all my problems, like... Thank you. Oh... I know what's gonna happen in this car. Wow. <laughs> They're, like, so happy together. Oh, that's so beautiful. So scary. Oof. You ought to melt every ice in the radius with that heat. Hot and steamy action right there on the steam train. <laughs> There's so much wordplay I can do with this. <laughs> no. I've got a better idea. I'm so glad he didn't... He looks like definitely the type that would break this picture that would tear it and he looks like the type gotcha. <laughs> smells like this is crazy <laughs> i know it doesn't make any sense that's why i trust it oh no <laughs> they are the future cool. look at that would you no yeah, Thank you. So calm and composed. I also have heard that it would have been better if they just ran it straight over. Like, just didn't try to steer, but tried to, like, face it straight on because the, the nose is stronger than the side. So if they hadn't tried to steer, they might have been okay. Oh, such slow mechanisms! It's so huge! That was a big hit. No. Such a big hit! No, all of the workers! And not enough lifeboats. Not enough lifeboats for even half the people. Yes, sir. Yes, there is. I have been robbed. Get the master at arms. Now, you moron. I have been robbed and the ship is sinking? Get your priorities. This is bad. We should tell Mother and Cal. <laughs> I think they're very good, sir. You realize it's bad? Even before, like... Oh no, he doesn't even know. 
Here we go. What the f Something serious has happened. You know I didn't do this, Rose. You know it. Don't you believe them, Rose? You know it. You know on, I didn't son, do let's it. Go. Rose, Come on, let's you know go. I didn't do, do it, Rose. Rose. Come on, there's a good lie. Come what on, the son. hell? Come on. How much time? Oh my god, the minute the reality sank in for all of them. <laughs> oh, it is a little sad, isn't it? You look at me when I'm talking to you. Kill him. Now, now we are busy. Go back and turn the heaters on in our rooms. I'd like a cup of tea when I return. Yes, ma'am. You're so lost in your own heads. I'll keep an eye on him. I... They don't even fucking know what's happening. And they're locking him there. All right, boys, like the captain said, nice and cheery so there's no panic. <laughs> Wedding dance. Here, yeah, put your life belt on. Yeah, come on. He didn't even get a lifeboat. Please stay calm. Look, please make sure they are locked down there? What the hell is this segregation? Between mommy, we're just waiting, dear. We're finished with our first class baby. We'll be starting with us and we'll want to be all ready, won't we? No. No, why? The boats won't even be enough for all the first class people. Look, there's men in there too. And they're not even full. Oh, this is so horrible. Imagine living through that. Just imagine living through this. I've been asked to give you this small token of our appreciation. <clears throat> Compliments to Mr. Caledon. Honestly, how? heartless do you have to be to do something like that like the ship is sinking he does it just because of his like satisfaction half the people on this ship are going to die not the better half come on ruth get in the boat first class seat she around. really said that he really said that come into the boat rose she would rather die than live like this i'd rather be his than your wife i said no <laughs> Oh! In his face! That's the least he deserved. No, that boat has five people in it! Break a thumb! Break a thumb! Oh my god. Jack. It's a little silver one, Rose. No, no, you don't have time for that. Hello, is there anyone here? No, there isn't! Oh my Hello. god, what are you doing? This is stressing me out. We need help. Hello? Hello? Don't just stand there like this. Oh my god, just do something. Oh no, this is really bad. Holy sh this is so scary. This is so scary. There's no need to panic. There's no need to panic. He probably needed that. It's good he took her there. There's no, there was no axe on on any of these walls up until now. Okay, they're gonna die from like electrocution. Oh my god, this is so scary. Oh no, oh no. Okay, it's not practice. Come Even on, I, I wouldn't be able to. Hands up a little more. No, oh, you have to like first. Like, you know, like if you're trying to hit here, like do this and then hit. You don't just like, oh, okay, I hope I hit it. <laughs> she closed her eyes! <laughs> she closed her eyes! Come on, let's go. I can't believe, like, they are the unluckiest lucky people. <laughs> this is so scary. This is so scary. There's nothing. It's the night. It's the scariest thing ever. Pitch black. Pitch black. It's not that well lit. That was that was lit. You can't see anything in the ocean. Anything. No. Are you serious? This is what happens when you repress people! 
They're attacking them. Now that is called for. Yeah, let's go. Yes, you. You, you white. You can't go there. Yes. I know it's not their fault, but I need to direct my anger towards someone. It's the guy that told them to advance full speed. It's the rich people going in half full boats. It's the other rich people who thought the bo the deck would be too crowded with the lifeboats. It's always their fault. It's never the sensible people's fault. What the f Nobody's listening to us anyway. Well, they don't listen to us at dinner either. Come on, let's play. Keep us warm. Music to ground, boy. Now I know I'm in first class. <laughs> Is the two worlds like colliding and all, all of the people in the second class and third class, they're still down there. I have an understanding. <laughs> with the children. <laughs> you don't even know who you're talking to. You can't even believe that this is happening. Come on, sir. Come on. Anyone else? Do hurry. Hurry along. Oh, God damn it, Lord Hill. What? I hope he drowns. I'm not going without you. No, you have to go. Now. Get on the boat. Yes, get on the boat, Rose. Get away from her. I'm a survivor, all right? Don't worry about me. Now go on. Get on. I have an arrangement with an officer on the other side. What's funny is that if she probably got on the boat, he would have probably survived. Because he would have got the door. Has anyone ever thought of that? Oh. <laughs> she made all these choices up until now, and now she's just like leaving without him. The ship is sinking and you're shooting each other. How many bullets are in this? Finally. It is a very cool pistol though. I hope you enjoy your time together. I hope you enjoy your time in hell after you drown. He's probably gonna survive though. It's always the fing evil bastard surviving. No! Who left him? No! Oh my god, no! The kid! Oh no! You can, like, break it? Is it that? It can be breaked! It can be broken! Just accept that you're dying anyway! And be calm! Swim from under! There is place for you to fit there! These are flimsy gates! They are so flimsy, you could have ripped them apart, you could have kicked them down. You busted through a solid wooden door earlier. And you're telling me you can't break these gates. I find that very hard to believe, okay? Oh my god, the speed of that sinking is- There's more boats! Now they're gonna break the rest of the boats. He left the kid. Your money can't save you any more than it could save me. Get back! No! No! He got pushed. she has in the world yeah you look at you definitely look related the two of you even when i was six my mother told me of the musicians who 
played until the very end. If something like this happened, would you just accept it and like let it happen? Or would you try to like fight it till the end? I think I would try to fight it. I would be one of those people going to the top. And this is all happening within, like this is real time, within an hour. That's what they said. And I think that's what's been happening. The movie, hour of it, because it's a three hour movie. I think an hour of it was the sinking. And I think it was like accurate in terms of how fast it happened. It happened so fast. No! No! No, Fabrizio! Why the f are people carrying their luggage? What the f is wrong with people? Look, he's carrying the rucksack! Oh my god, they're right back where they started. Where, where, where she wanted to jump. Well, now you get to jump. There you go. Oh my god, oh my god. Jack! This is where we first met! <laughs> oh my god. With the boat of 20 people! Damn you! Screw these people. Do you realize how dark it is? Like, yeah, the moonlight, it does not illuminate it that hot, that, that much. No way it was that bright. They were in pitch darkness, dying, sinking, not knowing what's happening. Like, if not the drowning, the shipwreckage itself would have killed all of the people. Imagine not seeing anything, pitch black, and just the screams of people dying. The screams of the ship sinking. So loud. Oh my god. I think your best bet is to let go at this point and try to swim as fast as you can, swim away from it. Because if you hold on, what's gonna happen? The ship is gonna suck us down. Take a deep breath when I say. It would sink with such enormous speed, I don't think anyone would be able to pull this off. It's gonna pull them down so hard. Harder than any current could. How do you know even which way the surface is? It would have been even stronger than that. It would have been a whirlpool. Like... It would have been much stronger. Oh my god. There's gonna be people holding on to people. There. There. They have to survive for three hours in the freezing water. And it's pitch pitch black. Well, maybe because it was a clear night, the moon was shining. But I don't think it would have been this bright. Go swim, find something else, you know? There, there are so many things to do in this situation. And I'm not sure how the science behind that works. Because she is soaked in the freezing water and she's right above the water. And still wet. Please help us! 
If we go back, they'll swamp the boat. They'll pull us right down, I'm telling you. Come on, girls. Grab an oar. Let's go. Are you out of your mind? We're in the middle of the North well. Atlantic. They do well. people want to live or do you want to die? Why don't these people swim towards the boats then? I would I have swam towards the... She's the, she's the most decent human being. If you don't shut that all in your face. Jesus Christ. The ugliest in people just comes out in situations like that. And if you're a good person, that really shows in situations like this. If you're a coward, it shows. If you're strong, it shows. Why don't you take turns? Why don't you take turns? Or swim! You said to yourself, swim! I love you, Jack. <laughs> don't you do that. You're gonna go on. And you're gonna make lots of babies. And you're gonna watch me. <laughs> Can she even have babies? She was just submerged in freezing water for our... Winning that ticket, Rose, was the best thing that ever happened to me. <sighs> It brought me to you. And I'm thankful for that, Rose. I'm thankful. <laughs> you must promise me that you'll survive. That you won't give up. No matter what happens. Promise me now, Rose. And never go of that promise. <laughs> I promise. <laughs> oh my god Check them, make sure. Please Oh my them. god Careful with your oars Don't hit them <laughs> We waited too long Well keep checking them Keep looking <laughs> <laughs> it's the song that he sang to her. There's a boat, Jack. She remembered her promise. Use the whistle. Oh no. I'll never let go. I promise. <laughs> life life jackets usually have whistles on them. She kept her promise. <laughs> Fifteen hundred people went into the sea when Titanic sank from under it. Fifteen hundred. There were twenty boats floating nearby. And only one came back. Six were saved from the water, myself included. Six out of fifteen hundred. Look at how many icebergs, and they said full speed. <laughs> she will never see him again. <laughs> Filthy bird. But the crash of 29 hit his interest hard, and he put a pistol in his mouth that year. So. <laughs> or so I read. Good. <laughs> Can I tell your name, please, love? Rose Dawson. Oh! <laughs> Not even your grandfather. A woman's heart is a deep ocean of secrets. <laughs> but now you know there was a man named Jack Dawson, and that he saved me in every way that a person can be saved. I don't even have a picture of him. He 
exist now only in my memory. We can draw the drawing though. What are you doing, lady? She's not gonna jump, is she? It's her favorite. Rose. Rose. She still has it? No way. No. Through all of that wreckage, these pockets are secure. My phone will fall out of my pocket if I sit down. She was underwater, above water, underwater again. Why? <laughs> Why would you drop it like that? <laughs> That's so much... <laughs> Potential fortune for your daughter. Oh, she lived. <sighs> and she rode horses like a man. <laughs> they could have had this life together. <sighs> Returning to the Titanic one last time. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> my god. <laughs> One last time. <laughs> That is so beautiful. I'm out of napkins. <laughs> you know it's a good movie when you're looking like this afterwards. <laughs> Damn, this is like the sweetest. This is such a beautiful story and so beautifully told. And like, I don't know if the love story with them is real but probably not but it's just so beautifully told in the lights of this thing that did actually happen and it's so bizarre and surreal that it did happen like and it was pretty close to what they what we just saw happen it's crazy it's so like blood chilling and right now like it's happening again there's just this eerie like aura around this ship isn't there like the unsinkable ship that sank on the first crusade and now people going back there and like tragedies happening again around it there's just this eerie like aura that just like don't mess with the titanic it's cursed like i believe in curses i believe that this can happen i just believe it's it's bad luck it's like really something some force is telling you not to mess with it and people went to mess with it and that's what happened it's insane and like imagine these people in that submarine like maybe they'll they'll have a movie of their own about them but it's not like thousands of people it was only five but still like trapped somewhere until their oxygen runs out that's crazy like imagine just knowing and then it's a pretty tight space it's really really small space there could be a movie about it someday and then 20 years 30 years there will be a package to go see that both the submarine and the titanic and then it will happen again because there's just something about it something about maybe this this place in the ocean Maybe it's some, like, forces in the ocean that are making this happen. I don't know. But I'm, I'm just leaving it. I'm never gonna even go over that spot. I really hope that it doesn't affect planes crossing. <laughs> it's, like, it's some supernatural, I don't know, occurrence. Such a beautiful story. So heartbreaking, too. And it's because, like, it happened and it adds an arch of, like, realism to the whole thing and you don't know what to think anymore 
<laughs> so sad. I have to hydrate and breathe some air now. So leave a like if you enjoyed and write in the comments what you would do if you were in a shipwreck. I like I think I would just try to fight until the very end. I'm not the type of person to just accept my fate early on. I want to like squeeze out as much as I can from it. So I would probably fight until the very end. Because see, sometimes it works out. Sometimes you live like Rose. And she held on for Jack and I will hold on for my cats, for Demi. <laughs> anyway, take care. Bye bye and I'll see you in the next one.